at Colorado Teardrops in Boulder. We make uh, travel trailers. Owner Dean Wiltshire and the staff. We are technologists, we're craftsmen, we're welders, we're uh, engineers. Are busy building campers that with more electric vehicles pulling campers and losing range. Slips through the air. That's actually more important than weight uh, for EV range now include some shocking campers built with batteries that will power your camping trip. You can use your inductive stove, your incinerator toilets, air conditioners and heaters while you're camping, off-grid remote. And can charge your electric car to add to its range. To support the electric vehicle. The uh, nice side benefit is, hey, we can power homes with these trailers as well. The way the campers are designed, you can use solar to charge your batteries while camping, or plug it in at home and use the batteries in the camper to power your house. And then when you get home, you can plug your uh, trailer into your home, and uh, your solar panels will fill up your trailer, and your trailer will power your house even during the evening. Right now, they have two battery designs, the Boulder. This is the Boulder. And okay. the Classic, and eventually, there'll be a few more. A Golden and a, uh, a big Denver with up to 200 kilowatts of energy. That may even include trailers with their own regenerative brakes. We're a very small company, and we have the attention of uh, large players like uh, Thor and Winnebago. All from a Colorado company that Dean says might be small. We're a tiny player playing with titans, if you will. But could have a big impact on camping in the future. We're inventing the future. We're embracing the future. Pretty cool campers that they just started building. So the boulder that we're in right now, their biggest battery pack won't be available until July of 2024. But they have a classic model that will be available this July. And then they have two more versions that they're likely going to come out with. One of them called the Big Denver that will have 200 kilowatts of energy with it. Jordan and Corey, like with all things technology driven, though, you're going to pay a little bit more for this stuff. Yeah, a typical camper here at Colorado Teardrops is about 40,000. You're going to spend an extra 20 grand to put those batteries in your camper, but they say the price will likely come down as the technology starts advancing a little bit. And of course, a lot of people here in Colorado, Matt, have a big interest in going electric. So you can imagine that demand for these once they become available is going to be pretty high. Is there a wait list already starting for people? Oh yeah, they've got a wait list of people that have already latched on to the boulder and so uh, and the classic even and so already people going to the website starting to uh, get in line for these things and take them out. You know, you think about it in Colorado, it's great because EVs are a lot quieter and then you, with these you don't have a generator, you don't have propane, it's all the batteries. So it's just a, a more natural, I guess, experience as far as noise goes out when you go camping. I really like them. They're nice. All right, Matt, thank you.